going on guys? Andy Grossman here with Pew Pew Nation and I'm here with another benchtop review of the FN 545. This is a brand new offering from FN. This thing just came out. Um, it is, uh, it's exciting to me because I'm a big FN fan. If you guys watch my videos, you know I personally carry an FN 509 midsize and then I rotate that out sometimes with my CC Edge as well. So I'm a big fan of the 509 series. Well, FN came out with a 545. Now what is the 545? The 545, honestly, uh, in essence, is a 509 in 45. Um, there's no other way to say it, honestly. So there you go. You can see the thing is clear. I got some clear mags here. Um, there's really no other way to say it other than that they've created a 45 caliber 509. And the 4, 545 is just that. So if you look at the gun itself, um, you can see it looks very, very sim uh, similar to a 509. So um, kind of a 509 tactical setup here with the MRD system and the uh, the wings on the back of uh, surrounding the, the rear sight there on the plate. Um, it, it looks very 509 tactical-ish. So again, it is a 45 caliber 509 is what I'm going to call this thing. It's a 545 is the model, but that's what it is. Um, with that being said, though, don't get me wrong. That's not a bad thing at all. That is a fantastic thing. Now, I can tell you I did get a chance to throw some rounds through this. I did not do video at the range, but this thing is a freaking tack driver. Um, the, the grip of the 509, and you're getting a full-size grip on this thing, um, it, it's just amazing. You also get the 15-round magazines. You get the giant extension on the bottom of this one. I think it's a five-round extension. So you get that big old... A big old full grip there. Um, super cool. You also get a smaller mag, which is just a 15 rounder. Um, I do think you could probably fit 16 or 17 in there because it does look like it's extended a little bit, maybe one round. Um, but just fits really nice. Nice serrations, the 509 style serrations. Um, it does have the MRD system, so you get all of your mounting plates come with it here in the little ugly bag that they send them in um you guys have seen my videos before you know my opinion of the mrd system i think it's a fantastic system i just hate the fact that they send these damn plastic plates um i can pull my cc edge off my hip right now and show you guys the gap underneath the optic it just it, it the, the plate just doesn't seemed i think it could be metal that's all i gotta say i know i'll get a bunch of shit in the comments for it like i always do and that's perfectly fine again the system is fantastic it's just they need to put metal plates in these things i know it costs a little more it might be a little harder whatever but it just needs metal plates that's all i'm gonna say either way it is a fantastic system you can mount any optic you want to this thing um because of the mrd system and how well thought out the system was uh, I just don't like those plastic plates, that's all. Uh, this thing does come with a threaded barrel. It is, again, chambered in 45. It's got some nice suppressor height sights on it, so you actually can co-witness um, your sights with um, uh, your red dot when you throw red dot on there. It is set up like a 509 tactical, like I said before, uh, with the wings on the back there covering the, um, the rear sight. So you do get that little uh, tactical look to it. Of course, it's in there beautiful peanut buttery FDE, which I love from FN. Um, has a very, very similar trigger to the uh, 509, <clears throat> excuse me, as well. Um, real nice, real short reset, uh, kind of gritty feeling, but this is only had, this probably had 50 rounds through it, so it's it, it didn't really have much break in yet. Um, but it does have a little, little grittiness to it there. You can kind of see it you know hang it up nice break though and then your reset super short super crisp um real nice just like all the uh, the fn stuff out there um i like this gun a lot it, it is ambidextrous you can switch everything around you can switch your uh um, your mag release around it does have different back straps that come in the bag here so you can change them out and customize this thing for your hands um, again, it does come in the real nice FD matching um, 
soft case that F that FN's been sending everything in these cases now. Um, and they're, they're really nice cases if you just are carrying a gun to the range or whatever. Um, but they're nice cases. Nice little package deal. I have no clue what this thing is going to cost yet. I would assume it's going to be in that eight nine hundred dollar range because of the um, FN five hundred nine tactical pricing. Um, so it should be. I would think these come in under a thousand bucks, which is honestly really it's not a bad price for what you get in the quality of the gun that you that you actually uh, get here. I personally love these guns. Like I said, I carry a five hundred nine CC Edge, and I swap that out with my five hundred nine midsize. Um, I'm very often I'm carrying a CC edge on my hip right now literally so um, you get the threaded barrel you get all that and you get that very ergonomic feel of the 509 package so I also have an FNX 45 um, I like the gun but it's got that big bulky kind of old um, 57 feel to it where it just had that kind of a strange like soft like a smooth grip and just I wasn't a huge fan of the feel of those guns. I like the function of them, but um, I'll tell you what, I have an FNX 45 and that will be going up for sale um, because I don't need two FN 45s personally, but this is going to be the new one in my collection because this 545 is honestly perfected. So shot amazing. I was pulling like half inch groupings at 25 yards right out of the box. I'm talking like I pulled this thing out of the box, went to the range, loaded mags and unloaded mags um, with zero malfunctions, shitty ammo, and it just ran. I definitely recommend checking out the new FN 545. Uh, this thing is just a, it's just a fantastic package. You can't go wrong with it. If you like your 509s, you can't go wrong with a 45 chambered 509 pretty much what you're getting here that's what i'm gonna say um so check them out fnamerica.com and uh make sure you guys hit that subscribe button hit that like make sure you uh leave us a comment too we love our comments we'd love to know what you guys like what you don't like about our videos um we will be doing a range review with this one very soon and you can also look for a full write-up in personal defense world magazine published by athlon outdoors so we'll see you all later Thanks for watching. Make sure you guys stay safe out there and carry on. Thanks, guys.